Hello all and welcome to the video on how to share your graph of your function. Um, what I've done here is I've actually graphed a cosecant function and what I'm going to actually do first is I'm going to go over here to this little wrench and I'm going to change my, uh, my graph a little bit. So it is in radians and you could change it to degrees but it makes a big difference. So leave it in radians and since we usually go from negative 2 pi to 2 pi, I'm going to say negative 2 and then type in pi and then change it to pi. And you go over here and I'm going to type that into 2 pi and that changes that nice and pretty. So your graph looks, you know, goes from a negative 6.28 to a positive 6.28. Um, and what you want to do is you want to share this. So you're going to go up here to this green button and you're going to create an account or um, if you already have an account, you're going to sign in. So if you don't have an account, you just create one uh, name, email, then you have to be a real email and a password. And then you click on create account or you can go here to sign in and I'm going to sign in with my Google account. So when I do this, uh, should be a good looking picture of me with my elf shirt on, I believe. And, and about now, there we go. Here's a good looking guy. <clears throat> so now that I am logged in, I can click on this right arrow. It says share graph. And if you, you could either send a link, but I'd prefer the image. So click on the image. And up in the top left, it'll say click this button to print or click the image below to download it. So I'm going to click to download it. And you can download it. The easiest place to find it would probably be on your desktop. So once you click on it, it's going to ask you a place to store it. Um, I'm going to choose desktop. Now mine's going to look a little different than yours because I have a MacBook, um, not a Lenovo or whatever you guys are using. So I am going to title it Trig Function Graph and save it. So now where in the world do we put this graph? Well, you're supposed to go to TL Campus, or not, yeah, TL Campus, and at the bottom of your announcement for eLearning Day Assignment 5, you are going to need to hit the reply button and you can attach your file. So choose a file and I will do my trig function graph. So I will say here is my graph. I hope you have a wonderful day, Mr. Klein. Because I know you all care about how my day is going today. Click on post reply and that is it. So uh, thank you for tuning in. Hopefully this will help you out. Have a great day.